Good morning and Merry Christmas. Well, it's Boxing Day now, but uh, yeah, we spent our Christmas here uh, floating between the free camp on the highway and Malakuta at the beach. And uh, yeah, we had an awesome time. I'll chuck in a couple of photos down here. And uh, summer has finally sprung. Yesterday it got to like 22 and it was cooking. It was only 22. Uh, today it's supposed to get to 32 and uh, yeah, it's feeling like it may get there so far. We're headed north. Uh, we're going to Naruma. Uh, I don't know what else we'll see, but uh, we will see you when we find some stuff to see. Yeah, so the camp at Janelle is pretty cool. There's a river just down here and the bridge over there. You can go and like kick around in the river underneath it. Uh, there's all the big cool trees and stuff and uh, there's no showers, there's only cold water, no power. But uh, it's donation so you can't complain about that. And uh, there's heaps of room and the grass is really nice. So uh, yeah, it's been a really cool spot to stay. Oh, and we found a wombat hole down in the back here the other day. And uh, so I've got the footage, I'll chuck that in here too. Oh man, so right behind where we camped, we're just up there like 10 metres. We found this big wombat hole. Look at this. It's huge, man. Like, I can climb down that. Um, we haven't seen a wombat yet. We're dying to see one in the wild, though. And uh, if you stand here and be quiet, every now and then you can hear like this... Boo, 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 like this low pitch noise. Like something thumping under the ground. And I think it's the wombat digging. So, yeah... It's uh, really cool. We're hoping we'll get to see him sometime tonight. We'll have to stake him out, maybe. Oh, yeah, Christmas wombat. It's going to be a mad dinner. All right, so we just crossed into New South Wales. There's no sign or nothing. There was a sign that facing the other way that said, like, Welcome to Victoria. And then there was one on the other side of the road that said, uh, Mobile... Uh, mobile phone and speed detection units used in New South Wales. And that, that's your <laughs> that, that, that's how South they welcome Wales, you to right? New South Wales, yeah. yeah, yeah. With, with a warning. Yeah. So, uh, yeah, and as the road's starting to turn the ground uh, here already. Yeah. So, yeah. Yeah, checks out. In New South Wales. <laughs> if I wasn't so lazy, we'd have like this mad like video montage of us building our snowman and like hugging on top oh, of the mountains. All the stuff we did in Victoria. All yeah. that cool stuff. So just imagine all that, <laughs> all the stuff we did in Victoria with some cool music. <laughs> and yeah, we're going to Eden. Guard the Eden, baby. Yeah. Welcome to Eden. And yeah, it's this mad big like double bass sort of thing. And like, yeah, it's awesome. The day is really cool too. Check this out. So this is only half the bay here. And there's another half of the bay around the other side of this headland here. But uh, it's a mad day. It's gone really foggy, all rolling in off the ocean and uh, mixing into the into the mountains over there. It's really, really cool. Yeah. Oh, what a mad first day of summer. Well, there's probably more like tourists here as well than we've seen anywhere except for the 12 apostles and the three sisters. So, uh, yeah, that's pretty cool. It's uh, not freezing anymore. You can actually go outside again. Oh, and all oh, the whole other side there was a big whaling station back in the day. And uh, they'd row out and, uh, and spear the whales in rowboats. <laughs> wow. <laughs> what a job. So we come over the other lookout. We were just standing over there on that point. And uh, the little bay here is just spectacular. The water down there is so crystal clear. Oh man, the snorkeling in there would be so good if it wasn't absolutely <laughs> freezing cold. Oh, what a day. Oh man, I wonder if I'm included in the approved people. I don't know. I've got the right safety devices, look. Got me pluggers on. Ready to go. So yeah, Eden's been mad. I'll go back down through the town and see the beach end next. Still heaps of tourists here too, eh? They're all looking at us. They're all wondering what we're filming ourselves for. <laughs> there's the Garden of Eden. And there's another one. And here's another one. 
Wow. Strolling through the Garden of Eden. Garden of Eden everywhere. <laughs> it's a mad spot though. So we've come down to the beach end. We were out on that big headland over there before. And uh, wow, it's spectacular. And how cool is the lunchtime fog? Like, it's so weird. You should be able to see like all the mountains over there and that, but it's just fog. So yeah, we're planning to be in Naruma today and Sydney for New Year's, but this place is pretty spectacular. It's going to be hard to like skip over all this really fast, but uh, yeah, Sydney for New Year, hope. Magic. Oh man, it looks so nice. It's kind of like Woodgate Beach on a really nice day. Woo! She's a little bit cool. Oh man, it's so, so good though. Oh, how cool is it? The color of the water is just mad here. Wow. Ah, now you committed in you get. Oh, she's in there now. Uh, so yeah, it's still not summer. Like, it, it's not gonna get above 25 today. It's like a really chilly breeze still. And uh, yeah, she's crazy. I love the New South Wales coast, hey. Every part of it's been spectacular. And uh, this is like the first town we've seen in the south coast. So uh, yeah, long way to go yet. And I guarantee ya, it doesn't get any worse. Remember that time we saw all them sharks at Seal Rocks? How epic was that, hey? That was so mad. I'd so love to see that again, eh? All the sharks swimming up the beach. Oh man. So Eden has been spectacular. The water here and the bay and the beaches is just like unbelievably nice, eh? Hey? Ah. New favourite place, Eden. Yeah, it, it could be the nicest place we've been. It kind of reminds me of like um, Broken Bay on the central coast and that kind of area. But just oh, heaps like less. Bay sort of thing. Yeah, le less crowded. But it was cool having the people there and the boats and that. And like on a really clear, spectacular day, this would be so much nicer. It's a really strange day. It wouldn't be like this maybe three days a year if you're lucky. Yeah, it's mad. Ah, oh, such a sick spot. But uh, now we got to keep going further north, up the south coast. And uh, yeah, we will see you at the next little town. So welcome to the servo at Marambula. And uh, this place is spectacular. There's like a big bay and like there's a bit of a road going across the middle of it that we'll go over when we leave here. But like, just look out the window. Oh, like, it's so mad, and it's all foggy over the hills and everything over there. Like, it's a mad place, and it's such a cool day. And the whole drive, like, between the last town and here has been, like, over all these little cool mountains and through valleys, and uh, all mad foggy, like, the clouds rolling through and stuff. It's, like, a really, really cool day. So the wombat's all full. And uh, yeah, check out this place here, eh? There's the boat ramp right there. And uh, we're gonna drive over the middle of the the big inlet now, yeah. Ooh. It's uh, oh. it's really, really cool. <laughs> and uh, we're staying, oh, I think we've got to go about another 20 or 30 k's north up the south coast. And uh, we'll be where we go. Oh, it's so cool. Oh, what a mad yeah. spot, eh? Heaps of oyster fishing. Oh man, it's like you're in the ocean just here, right? Oh wow. Oh, and it's getting really cold too, eh? And windy, oh, yeah. So much for summer. We had like a couple of hours on Christmas Day. This morning was a little bit warm. It's all over now. <laughs> so, uh, welcome to Tathra. This is the next little town up the road and uh yeah this is mad spot they got a pub here from like 1888 and uh, i don't know if it was like a timber town or a wayland town or a gold rush town or like just a, a service port or what but uh yeah this is it 
Now we're gonna go to Beaker and uh, eat some cheese. The wombat found a friend, and uh, oh, Beaker sounds really good. The showgrounds is twenty dollars with power and everything, and apparently there's a heated pool. Amy, hey, what a funny day! <laughs> yeah, it's uh, warmed up, and uh, yeah, we're in Beaker, and uh, yeah, once we got off the coast, the fog stopped and it warmed up, and uh, yeah, it all turned into like dairy farm country, and uh, yeah, on the other side of them hills. Is the beach, it's not very far away, and uh, it's so much warmer though, it's so nice, and you can see it's still like foggy over there, even. But... Yeah, it's pretty cool, away. Eh? All the houses in the streets are really nice, and uh, really old school, like eh? everything's like turn of the century looking and stuff, it's mad. Yeah, so bigger Main Street's pretty cool, too, eh? Mad old pub and clock and things, and it's just uh, really little and country, and uh, they've even got a super cheap. So I'm guessing they got a Bunnings as well, man. So Beaker's got like everything, eh? Kinda. Check it out. It's Icy the Snowman. He's all cracked out. Oh, an old Santa over here. He looks pretty relaxed, and like he's that out of it. He's beside himself. <laughs> Check out the logo on this place. It's the Peanut Eatery, but uh. Reminds me of eating something else. You're no, eating something else, no, doesn't Not that I've what ever eaten it. <laughs> oh man, they do have everything. Look, there's the dirty bird. And uh, listening to the people out the front, it sounded like it's filthy in there. So uh, yeah, probably don't eat there. So yeah, that's been a little bit of bigger. This is bigger showgrounds. This is where we're staying. It's uh, 20 bucks powered. And uh, yeah, it's mad in the bigger valley here. And uh, yeah, tomorrow we'll get some cheese and we will see you there. Dun, 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 dun.